In this video, I want to present the case of how Final Cut could be saved without too much effort and could actually make a lot of editors happy. So this is a pie in the sky idea, but it's not so far removed from reality that it couldn't happen. It would take two companies working together, Apple and Blackmagic. Now imagine a world where Apple introduces more AI tools into Final Cut, but keeps it streamlined and doesn't add any more complexity to it. But they do add a handoff feature to DaVinci Resolve. Picture this, you're working on your base edit, you're doing everything you need to do, you're adding your graphics, your effects, titles, whatever. You press one button and it hands it off to DaVinci to do your final color grade, add more high-end graphics and visual effects, and do your final mix and then export. This is more than just an XML export and bringing in your timeline. This is taking all the effects that work in Final Cut and making them work in DaVinci Resolve as well. So the people that want a very simplistic and streamlined editor can use it and they can finish their video. But editors that love using the magnetic timeline and all the features that Final Cut has to offer, but need all the higher end tools that DaVinci offers, a handoff tool would be amazing. If there was a way that these two companies that are already working together and have shown that they work well together and just be able to bridge the gap. I know that this sounds crazy, but it's not impossible. There are round tripping tools between other apps. It would be something akin to Adobe's dynamic link between Premiere Pro and After Effects, where the two apps just understand that they are working together. I wouldn't want it to be a round tripping tool. I would want it to be a handoff tool where you do as much as you can in Final Cut. And when you need to elevate and escalate the complexity, that's when you hand off to DaVinci Resolve. It's a simple idea, probably way more complex than I'm making it sound, but knowing Apple's software engineering and Blackmagic's commitment to working together, it is something that could happen. But if Apple does choose to go it alone, in this video, I talk about the two futures of Final Cut Pro and where Apple could head with it. Also, I live stream on my second channel where I deep dive on the creative process as well as freelance financials. So make sure you check that out. As always, thanks for watching.